Welcome, ladies and gents, back to the 3L channel where we live and learn by listening. Thanks so much for tagging along this weekend as we dive into yet another episode of our Classics Marathon. How's everybody's weekend so far? Hopefully you're feeling great and got those positive vibes. If not, I hope the music this weekend for the marathon will uplift your spirits. Folks, listen up. If you're new here to the channel, just visiting for the first time, my name is Chad. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Kick your feet up, relax, enjoy some great music from the yesteryears. We love taking that time machine way back and picking up these classic gems. And by the way, you guys saw the title in the thumbnail. I just have to say that I've had so many comments and emails about this woman and particularly the first time ever I saw your face being one of the greatest love songs ever written. Now that's a pretty strong statement. And then when I went and reacted to it, I could see clear as day what they were speaking of. Absolutely breathtaking, ultra romantic as one person put it. We just don't have love songs like that anymore, folks. But anyway, without further ado, I'm not gonna waste any more time. We're gonna jump straight into this reaction with Miss Roberta Flack. Stay tuned. Live, 1973. Can't wait. Let's dive in. Killing me softly with this song. Killing me softly with this song. Telling my own life with his words. Killing me softly with this song. Classic song.
so talented. Cool touch to the song. Chills all down my arms. <laughs> well, yet another classic in the books for the 3L library. And I've got to say, at every note, every key, the entire vibe is just spectacular. So soulful. And you know what? I just can't imagine someone killing her with his song. No, she's killing all of us with hers. <laughs> Tell me something, folks. I didn't have a chance to do research. Was that something that she wrote herself, or was that a cover, or was it just already written and given to her to perform? You guys let me know. Fill me in in the comments because I'm not sure of its actual origins. But anyway, love this live performance. Some people prefer studio version of songs. I do too. You know, it depends on what it is. It depends on what it is. And sometimes I like to do live because then I can see the actual artist in their element, you know, up on stage. And to me, that's how you can gauge an artist, you know, in the moment in front of a crowd and you can see the whole delivery process. But anyway, yes, I have heard the, the shortened radio version of this. I thought it would be cool for reaction purposes uh, that I would react to the live one as I've never seen it before. And you know, the instrumentation was off the charts. I like that extra extended flair that they did uh, in between verses. Love Roberta's soft yet powerful voice. Definitely timeless, definitely a classic. Thanks so much for this request, folks. Again, you guys know what you're talking about. I put my faith and confidence in you, and I'm never disappointed. Thank you so much. Until next time, folks.
take care.